Hey people, I'm Burnt Pan, but you can call me JJ if you prefer not to call someone a burnt kitchen tool. I already made a video about why virtual reality is so great and mentioned Dungeons of Eternity in there a lot, but I did say that it would take a whole video in and of itself to explain why this specific VR game is so amazing. Here is that video. To start, just keep watching this video as you listen. This gameplay only scratches the surface, but the graphics are amazing for standalone VR, the physics-based combat is truly awesome, and it really does feel like you're exploring dungeons while killing monsters in a fight to save the planet of eternity. Well, maybe not that last part because the fantasy sci-fi lore behind the game has some room for improvement. However, I do think that was intentional from the dev team for them to circle back in the future. Anyway. As I mentioned in the other video, there hasn't been a VR dungeon crawler quite like this one before. Let me start by giving praise to the developer team, Othergate, for their amazing work so far. Not only did they release this game 5 days before the Quest 3, they also optimized the game to take advantage of the Quest 3 hardware and still work well with the more budget friendly Quest 2. They could have stopped there because this game was already amazing on launch, but they didn't. They are still actively working on their game, and they seem to truly care about their player base. I'm very confident in Othergate's decision making, and that they'll continue to keep making this game even better than it already is. While I know other VR dungeon crawlers do exist, and I've heard some pretty darn good ones, this might be the only one on the Quest Store, which by the way is currently the most popular VR platform. I say popular, but gaming in VR is still a niche, so I can't compare the Quest Store to something like Steam on PC. However, I do believe P VR is on the trend to becoming mainstream in more than just gaming. On the gaming side though, I think Dungeons of Eternity is at the top. Stats might not show this, but from what I can tell this game has incredible potential after successfully launching on the two most popular consumer grade VR headsets on the market. Now Dungeons of Eternity did limit their release to a standalone VR headset, so you can't play on PC VR but I am going to try to explain why that was a great choice without getting too technical. For one, tethered and wireless PC VR can work fairly well with the right setup, but the barrier to entry is a little too high for the average consumer. Therefore, most VR consumers are using standalone Quest VR headsets, which have only recently in the past few years started to compare to PC VR. So, by Othergate targeting Dungeons of Eternity at more than just fanatics from PC VR, Dungeons & Dragons, or World of Warcraft, they have successfully launched a game that almost anyone can get their hands on and love playing. I do want to wrap up my Dungeons of Eternity praise by saying that Othergate has made a game that is nearly perfect for VR. The awe factor that so many people experience when they first try virtual reality is encaptured so well within this game. While the experience is astounding, the gameplay itself is simple in concept, which is better than you might think for VR. Also, while you work on improving your in-game character, you will also be honing your real-life combat skills to slice, whack, or snipe your way to victory. It might also surprise you to find how ironically realistic they made this fantasy sci-fi game. From your in-game fingers individually colliding with objects to the archery impressing some of the most experienced archers, you might never want to go back to a flat screen PC or console again. Now obviously Dungeons of Eternity can't be all sunshine and rainbows, so let me touch on the room for improvement. There is some, but nothing compared to the majority of VR games. There are some common bugs, many that have been fixed, some that you may or may not have noticed, there are weapon imbalances, and there's a holiday update that might have not been fully thought out. As I said, this game would still be amazing without any future updates, yet Othergate continues to work on it and anyone that tries this game can understand why they do. This is the future of gaming, another way of life that everyone can enjoy together. And to finish up this video, I do want to mention that I tend to turn into a salesman when I get passionate about something, so just know that this video is not sponsored by Dun Dungeons of Eternity. I do just love the game and want to share the experience with whoever I can. Let me know what you think in the comments below, feel free to like, subscribe, and I hope to see you on the planet of eternity. Peace.